hi and welcome to another video in the last video i showed you how to use this ups power backup to ensure that you can power your router or camera or whatever it is during a blackout in this video let's talk about a cheaper alternative this alternative simply involves buying a dc cable like this one you can see this cable is 12 volts all you have to do once you buy this cable is connect it to your power bank and then connect it to your router and you're going to see your router will turn on for this cable i'm using 12 volts usb to dc cable and it's 12 volts so if you want to know the correct voltage for your router you'll have to look at your router's adapter so my adapter cable is that and for this one is 12 look at the output section if you look somewhere here you're going to see there's an output so look at the output it's probably going to tell you something like 12 volts 1 amperes or 9 volts 1 amperes and that's what you go with so make sure you buy the right cable in my case i need 12 volts to sum it up buy the cable and you also need a power bank just make sure that the output of your device does not exceed the output of your power bank so the power bank usually the power bank most of them the small ones will probably have a maximum output of 20 watts so make sure that the calculation of your voltage so let's say this is 12 volts and 1 amperes so that means that this is going to take 12 watts if it is 12 volts and 1.5 amperes it's going to take 18 watts so it's just voltage times ampere will give you the total wattage and that should not exceed your power bank that should cover it for this video but i still recommend you go with this and the reason i recommend this is because this is like a ups you'll just connect it constantly to power and there won't be any disruptions you won't have any disruptions when power goes out your devices will continue to work your router will continue to work so I'm going to put the link for both of this in the description. If this is something you want, you can look at the links and see how much it costs. This is very cheap. It's less than a dollar. I think it's less than $1 uh, depending on where you are. There will be there might be some postage fees, but naturally it will be less than 3 $5 in total. All right, that should cover it for this video. See you next time in another one.